guys and welcome to my channel my name is just and in today's video i'm going to do a haul for you guys before i get into the haul i just want to explain to you why i've been so mia from youtube for the last couple of weeks um honestly it was not my decision to be mia for so long i actually have pre-recorded videos that i never put up just because i didn't really like how they came out um but there's a lot that has been going on and as you can see i have a different background which is not going to stay like this um it does look a little messy and crazy i do need to fix that but um, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to film and how I'm going to do a different background just because I don't really have the same amount of space that I used to in my room anymore. So, um, yeah, it's just a little bit complicated, but please bear with me. I am so happy that I have so much support from you guys. I actually want to thank you guys for hitting 100 subscribers. I know it is not a lot at all, but for me, it means so freaking much. And I really appreciate all the support that I've been getting from all of you guys. Your comments are so sweet. And I'm sorry if I don't respond to some of you guys, but trust me i read them all and i love you guys so much and i really appreciate it um especially to you guys that know me um i know a lot of people that know me are subscribed to me and i really appreciate that as well um but i am so sorry that i've been so mia lately if that makes sense but don't worry i'm going to try to keep bringing videos out for you guys i'm going to keep trying to um do spring tutorials and all those type of tutorials just because i love to do it honestly i don't wear makeup every day i just all the makeup that I have is honestly for YouTube because it is a hobby of mine, not because I wear makeup every day. I really don't. I wear makeup like literally once in a blue. Like this week I've worn it twice in a row and that never happens. Like I really don't wear makeup just because I don't go out anywhere. So I don't feel the need to put makeup on every day. So um, I did buy a lot of stuff in the last couple of weeks. Like it's kind of ridiculous. And even like a couple months ago, but I never spoke about. So I want to like speak about it in the beauty haul so you guys know what I've been doing what I've been buying just for this channel because I love this channel this is my baby and a lot of people don't understand why I started YouTube well um a brief backstory I started YouTube because I did get surgery last year which was June of last year 2015 and I couldn't really sit and like do anything because I did have surgery like my lower back but I didn't really care. I was just going crazy in my house. I was like, I couldn't walk for like at least like two months. So I couldn't like, I was just going crazy and I was like, you know what? Forget about it. My summer's already ruined. I'm just going to start doing YouTube and I'm going to see how it goes from there. Um, I didn't expect to even get 100 subscribers. I expected like the max 20. Like you had to see me when I hit 20 subscribers. But that's the reason why I started YouTube in the first place. Um, I'm not trying to get anything out of this. This is only a hobby. And I really try to put videos up. And I'm trying to improve my production. Even though right now it just doesn't look like I am. But I'm trying to improve everything. It's just been such a hard time. And not everybody supports what I'm doing. A lot of people laugh when I tell them I do YouTube. So sometimes it's embarrassing. It's not even embarrassing, I just don't like the criticism from people because they don't even know why I do what I do, but whatever. Besides the point, um, this has been a very long intro, so if you want to skip ahead, you're more than welcome to. Um, but I want to do a haul, it has beauty products and everything in it because I don't really speak about beauty products just because I don't really like, so you can see my hair, it's like crazy half of the time, but I do try to maintain my curls, which for you curly-headed girls, you know the pain, you know the pain. So I do have a lot of, um, so I do have a lot of products that I've gotten, um, I've gotten from like influencers and stuff that I want to speak about and review for you guys. So this is going to be like a beauty haul slash, um, review of all the products that I did use and some of that I didn't use. So, um, let's just get right into it. Um, again, I'm sorry if my makeup looks crazy. I've been having this makeup on for like, what, like almost 11 hours. By the way, I'm loving this foundation. It's a new foundation I will be speaking about in this video. And, excuse the t-shirt, but this is just how I roll. Um, let me just drink some water. Okay. So, I want to start with beauty pro- well, I mean with hair products just because I have a lot of it. And most of it I did not purchase. Um, and no, it is not a sponsor video whatsoever. Um, I got from Influencer. If you guys don't know what that is, that is a website where you can sign up. Anybody can sign up. And you do surveys and whatever they feel like whatever they're sending out that month or whatever a couple weeks they feel like you um approve or like your um how to say if you're qualified for the campaign they'll send you out a survey they'll let you fill it out and then if you do qualify then they'll send you the products um so yeah anybody can sign up this is not only for me i will link the link down below and 
you guys definitely need to go check it out. You don't get stuff every month. It's not like a subscription thing, but you definitely get something if you do qualify for their Vox Box. That's what they call it, a Vox Box. So I'm going to start with the hair products they sent me. Um, um, let's start. Okay, so I'm going to start with the Pantene Intense Hydration Shampoo. It looks like this. Um, I have not used it yet, but it smells so good. And I actually love, I love Pantene for my hair. Um, this is like such a good, um, hair product, hair shampoo or conditioner for, um, curly hair. I don't know for like straight hair. I don't really know because I don't have straight hair, but this is a really good, like, Pantene I really like. I don't know why I don't really buy it as much. When I was younger, I used to buy it a lot. Like when I was like 15, 16, Pantene was my go-to. But I did read in an article that like your hair gets used to stuff. Like you have to change your shampoo and conditioner like every six months or something like that. So that's what I do, honestly. I don't stay with the same shampoo and conditioner for too long because my hair does get used to it. That's like with, yeah, with gel. I've been trying to find out a gel that like actually works with my hair, but... I can't find anything because the only one that used to work for me was the Eco, Echo style gel. Um, and now I can't find any other one that works well with me. But I've I really like this shampoo honestly, just because I've. But well, I don't know this particular like campaign or whatever the hell they want to call it. I don't know about this one, but I do love Pantene shampoos. So next, I'm gonna speak about um these are actually body washes which I also got from Influencer. The Pantene I got from Influencer, and these are from Influencer. The first one is the Olay um energizing. Where is it? Olay energizing um body wash. This thing is like huge. It is 23 ounces. You get full size products. You don't get sample size products. Oh, and it smells so good. I'm so like crazy to try this out um i do have another one well let me just finish with this one it smells so good i've never tried olay um anything so i'm really excited to try this out i'll try some of these things out that i haven't tried that i'm going to speak about here and then i'll let you guys know if i like it or not um but yeah i'm really excited to try the olay one and then i also got this head and shoulders um dandruff shampoo and conditioner um this one's really good but me personally i don't like head and shoulders i don't like how it works I don't like the two in ones either. I feel like those are so bad for the hair, in my opinion. Like, if you're gonna use this, like, I don't find it really well. Like, it doesn't really work for me, anyways. So, and I think I'm gonna give this away. I just really don't like head and shoulders for me. Um, I haven't even tried it. Maybe I'll give it a try. I don't know, but let's see. Um, then another thing that I got from Influencer, which I am obsessed with. I'm obsessed with. This is the L'Oreal um, Advanced Hair Care um, Extraordinary Oil Nourishing Shampoo and Conditioner. Guys, these are my new holy grail. Um, it has argan oil, coconut oil, uh, um, oil, soja, sunflower, and camomo oil. I don't know, but it has all these hairs and it's for like it says it for dry lifeless hair and it's lightweight and non-greasy it definitely is non-greasy i absolutely love this shampoo and conditioner the shampoo the shampoo alone you can like after you use it you can definitely notice that it's doing something really nice for your hair like your hair is already soft and then when you put the conditioner it's just so good this is like my favorite product right now i actually told my friend to use it and she uses it on herself and her son and she like you could notice it on her son. Her, his hair looks so good after using this. This is honestly such a good product and you guys should definitely go get it. Especially if you have dry and lifeless hair because it is not greasy at all. Like you won't feel the greasy but it, you can for sure know that it has oil in it because it will leave your hair like so nice and hydrated. This I highly recommend. I also got from Vox Box. This is all for testing purposes by the way. Like they send you stuff to see if you like it and then you review it and I guess that's how they like make their business to see if people like their products or stuff the products that they're sending out but this i highly recommend honestly like this is my new favorite like shampoo and conditioner i really hope i can use it for a long time because how i said i have to change shampoo as conditioner a lot because my hair doesn't stick to one thing because it wants to be picky like that but i also got the l'oreal um advanced hair care um lustrous oil serum which i've been using like when i wash my hair i just put this on it and for your curly head girls you guys know you can't just have curls without putting anything in it because you look crazy but this is all i put in it this little oil serum and um let me tell you something everybody has given me so many compliments since i've been doing this where i just leave my hair out everybody has been loving it like they're like what are you putting in your hair it looks so nice and this is the only thing i put in my hair i don't put anything else so i'm really glad i'm really glad 
Um, moving on. I have a whole bag. I put it in an H and M bag just because my Rite Aid and like Target bag and all my other bags broke. Yes, and I have a dog that likes to chew through everything. So, um, I have it in an H and M bag, but I have a lot of stuff. Okay, this is one thing that I've actually been trying to, to talk about, which I buy like religiously, and this is the Caress Fine Fragrance. Um, what's it called? Body wash, guys, guys. And it has to be the black bottle, not any other bottle. The black bottle. This has been my holy grail. I speak about it on Snapchat all the time, which you guys should follow me somewhere, you know, follow me. Um, on Snapchat, just, I'll put, the, I'll put it somewhere around here, here, here. And it's going to be in my description box as well. But this is the best thing I've ever tried. I used to not believe in body wash or soap in general. You know how, like, some people, someone would take a shower, and when they come out, you just smell the, like, the soap on them? I always felt like every time I took a shower, I would never smell the soap on me. And I would like rub the soap on just to make sure that it smells. But I felt like I never smelled it on myself. With this is a whole different story. It says 12 hour fragrance. And honestly, it lasts a long time on your body. Um, every time I use this, my boyfriend is like, well, damn, you smell good. And this is a new fragrance and I'm obsessed. It smells like straight up perfume or like body spray. This one I've already used. They have three colors, I believe. There are only three. This is the new purple one, and then it's called Mystic Forever. I've used the red and the pink one, and I'm obsessed with both of them. So, the red is my favorite, but this one I think is going to be my favorite very soon. I'm just waiting to finish my other bottle. I buy this every time I literally, one bottle's gone, I go and buy my other one. Way, right before one bottle's like already completely done, I go and buy another one. Um, Just because I love this product so much i just absolutely love it my sister be trying to use it and i'm like no no honey no i did not pay six dollars for you to be using my own my body wash go buy your own so this is like my all-time favorite right now i always rave about it i always tell people to go buy it because honestly it's my favorite body wash of all times i don't know if i should split this into two just because to two because it's so much stuff that i have to speak about and this is gonna be such a long video so i think i'm just gonna stick to like hair care and body wash in this part and then i'm gonna go to like beauty in another part so okay i'm gonna continue and i'm gonna be speaking about hair now um well i'm going to continue to speak about hair so uh, the other, another thing that i got for hair which was a scalp thingy from sally's it was like a something my hair in my nose i got a sleep cap whatever because i want to start doing this treatment on my hair um, just because I feel like I'm getting bald here, like I have little bald spots, so I'm gonna see if I can fix that, see if I could like make my hair grow. So this is um, a sleep cap, which I got from Sally's, nothing special. So when I went to Sally's, I was looking for almond oil and olive oil for hair. Not olive oil for cooking, for hair. Don't get olive oil for cooking, I don't know if that's good for your hair. But I got this for hair, and the olive oil it says it helps fight hair breakage. Um, it helps with scalp treatment, add shine, heat protection, you can use it on your body and nails or whatever. And then almond oil contains is rich in folic acid, which is really good for the hair. It contains vitamin E, nourishes hair strands, hair follicles, and encourages growth, which that's what I want. So I'm using these two, but I'm going to mix it with castor oil. Okay, so let me tell you my story. I was looking online that Jamaican castor oil is really good for the hair, like Jamaican black castor oil. So I bought this Jamaican mango and lime Jamaican black castor oil from Sally's. But then I went online and I was looking at some reviews. A lot of them were really good and then some of them scared the living shit out of me. Like, I was like, Because ah. they say that this brand is not as good as the original castor oil, which I eventually got. But, um... I don't know. I don't know if I want to use it or not because I'm very skeptical with stuff in my hair because I do not want to go bald. But then I got the original, which is by Tropic Isle Living. It's not by Jamaican Mango and Lime. It's this bottle, which is a lot bigger than this one, by the way, and I paid, like, cheaper than this. So um, this is the Jamaican Black Castor Oil, um, and it says all-purpose healing oil. I've heard so many great reviews about, about this, so I want to use it, and I'm going to mix it with the um, olive and almond oil just because this is, like, very thick like very thick so i want to try this but i don't know i'm very skeptical about it too just because i don't trust anything from online like people like to like you know fake stuff and like put counterfeit stuff you know like i bought it from amazon but i'm still very skeptical so i don't know i'm gonna try it i don't know yet 
but i think that that is it for all the um hair products i think so i think that's that's all for the hair products and i'm just gonna leave it at that for this part of the video and then obviously i'm gonna have a second part right after this one um with all my hair product i mean with all my makeup just because this is already like 20 minutes long and i don't want to bore you guys so um yeah i'll see you guys in the next in part two of this um beauty haul um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this part. It is talking about hair and like body wash and stuff, which I never do. So I really hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, but I'm going to jump into makeup now. So if you want to see the makeup portion of this video, then just go to part two. Um, I love you guys and I'll see you later.